down. Up. What was that? That was me. <laughs> Kick, spin. All I can hear left, right, left, is the bloody right, tooting. Left, right. Hello everyone and welcome back to Worst Games Ever. It's the show where we play terrible video games sent in by you. My name is Peter. My name is Ben. And uh, you'll be able to send it, you are able to, well, when's this going out? Hmm. I think it, we're still good. Yeah? I think we're still good. You certainly have been able to send in more video games for us because the tat appeal is open and has been open at time of recording. Address on screen. Address on screen, assuming it's still good to send. I think it is, I think you're right. You don't have long. I think you've maybe no. got a few days. Yeah. But uh, there it is, that was the address on the screen. Send in some games for us to play. Mm. Uh, when we do play those games on this show, we have two roles, don't we, Ben? We do indeed. I am this week's, no, your first, the game's victim. Ooh. Which means I have to play the terrible video game uh, that Ben has brought along, along with some facts about it, meaning he is the game's master. Mm. Peter Austin, would you like to know what game you're playing this week? I'd love to know that. If we're going back to an old classic. Ooh. Please put your hands together for Mary hyphen Kate and Ashley. Oh, Crush Course. Oh, Crush Course. Going to learn all about it's crushes. It's not a racing game. Oh. It's, you know, because it sounds a bit like maybe a monster truck game. It's a course. Yeah, it does. The Crush Course. It but sounds... you correctly identified it almost immediately. It's about love. Yeah. Well, I got the or love lust, bit. I suppose. Love or lust. But then lust. also, course could be, it could be a, a love based. Golf game? Yes. Or Horse a, racing? A Tour de France leg. Yeah, it could. Um, should we find out what manner of love we're going to... Oh, we should react... Oh, there it is. Oh! Forgot to... There it is. Incredible. Uh, should we find out what kind of love we're doing? I suppose we should find that out. I already know. It'll well, sound yeah, to you do. Find I'll out. find out now. <laughs> Chris Mary Hyphen... Uh, the Ashley's quite hard to read. Yeah. Oh, real games for real oh, girls. Oh, yeah, that's it. Yeah. Are you going to tell us all about the, the lawsuit and stuff? Not this time. Not this we've time. Got, if you want to learn about the lawsuit, watch other Mary Hyphen Kate and Ashley. I think we've covered it twice. America Online Keyword. AOL. Good mm. morning and welcome to another fun filled Bally. 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 Oh, look at this radical dude. Oh, dude, it could be a dude at. Could be. Whoa! Oh, how'd he do that? Defying gravity. Flipping oh, there they go doing some fl literal flipping hack. Look at the crowd, they're going wild. There they are. The good is thing it, about... Oh, is this them? I'm not sure about that. Is that this Mary gesture. hyphen Kate and Ashley? I think it could be. Yeah. Oh yeah, they're just doing all the sports because they're amazing, aren't they? Right, yeah. Um, the good thing about Mary hyphen Kate and Ashley is that you're able to create a game with two protagonists using only one model. Yeah, that's true. They are the same person. Yeah. You ever seen them in the same place? No. I think so. They're famously never in the same place. There she goes. Take my photo. Wait, so we're going to be doing all of these different things. Don't worry about it. Basketball. Don't. Photography. I tell you what. Don't. Don't. Why don't you just not worry about it? Didn't we do photography uh, once with Mary Hyde and Kate and Ashley? Yeah, we took. We were perving on the boys. In remember? a different game. Was that a different game? I guess yes. it must have been. Do they not think who is this girl who's coming and standing near us all the time? And she's her, standing so close to her them. friend. <laughs> just me and my buds. Just me and my friends. This feels like it's basically... Oh, that was Mall something or other, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. Magical Mystery Mall. Cool menu. Okay, here we go. Would you like to learn a little bit about this game? I'd love to. Meet the boys. Oh, let's go to options first. There's yeah. nothing online about this game at all. Oh, no. No reviews, no Wikipedia article. There's a couple of scant previews, including that really messed up screenshot I sent you from an, from an IGN article that said something along the lines of, we may be able to find it and put it on screen. It was like, celebrate with us 
the fact that or the countdown towards these two girls becoming legal oh, marrying age yeah. or something like that. Yeah, that's a real byline from an IGN article. Uh, it's good. Really good stuff. Mary hyphen Kate and Ashley <laughs> Crush Course is a mini game collection adventure game for the PlayStation One, PC, and Game Boy Color. <laughs> it was developed by Unspace, published by Acclaim, and released on August the 29th, two thousand and one. I think we're going to meet the boys in a second. Yeah, I like the Willy Wonka called font. Corey for Chad. sure. Oh, no. Corey. Did you catch our math team finals on TV? Absolutely. I rigged it up to play on the TVs in the physics lab. Right. So, so Chad is the nerdy one. Nerd! Bruce, uh, his hobby is biking, mm -hmm. but he's found in the skate park. Was he in the opening? Yeah, probably. Video. His favorite tunes are dance. Chad, of course, is Scorpio. Favorite food, wings. Uh, his hobby is RC cars. It's, a, it's an expensive hobby. It's a bit yeah, of a strange he's hobby. Seen in the music store and listens to pop tunes. Ah, oh, so he's one of the goths that hangs outside HMVs. Then. Oh, oh, you can oh, cycle there's, through. There's Dylan yeah, and a Brandon. Oh wow! 24, Do we get to choose all 32, of these? Forty-four on two. Hut hut hike. And Brandon connects for the TD bomb with only seconds on the clock, while Dylan hits an eagle on his final five holes to take home the title. Brandon, can you step away from the uh, from the microphone slightly Some there? Space <laughs> war, war, war. You tell us something your mum doesn't know. Oh. But who else you got? All uh, right, Aaron. Yeah. Just a couple more shots and I'll be ready for an edit session. Hey, save some film for my beach bash performance. He dropped beach the microphone bash. at the end there. Beach bash performance. Hobby hey. making videos. See, Brett is, is that's us, look. He hangs out at the video store. Yes. He makes videos. He loves heavy metal. He likes burgers and fries. Mm -hmm. uh, Aaron, of course, hobby is BMX, not riding bikes. I which love was BMX. The first person. Dude, you're gonna come by and join my favorite skateboard food, session junk while my food. parents have the water out of the pool? Sounds totally cool. Count me in if the waves aren't happening this weekend. Will the waves happen this weekend, do you think, Peter? No, the moon we goes now, away We briefly. now go to Tim with the weather, who will tell us if the waves are happening. Are the waves weekend. happening, Tim? No. no. <laughs> go, Bobcats, Whoa. go! Check out this hot new dance routine. Right, okay, we've got snowboarding. Um, clubs. Clubs. He's not allowed in clubs, is he? How old is he? He looks like he's about to break his neck every time. He looks time. Like, a, like he's about to break the laws of physics every time. Nathan's neck briefly goes transparent. You can see the stands behind him. You ready? Look at his neck. There oh, it goes. Yeah, yeah, there like it a goes. South Park character. Yeah, it's good. Hurry up and get, get dressed for school. You've got to get dressed first before you can go to the school. The bus will be here in just a few minutes. I like it. This outfit is totally cool. I mean, You're really good at this, Peter. Have you done this before? Yeah. We're gonna go with the the pink. Oh. Hello, fashion world. Yeah, we're gonna have them basically there? wearing the same thing. Just talking over Tension. each other. Yeah, that's for whatever. Yeah. I love MK. My and a. job. <laughs> Whose locker was? Was that their locker? I think so. So they've got a little poster in there. It's a skeleton look. Yeah, I know. Oh, that's one of the boys I want to meet. Back. There's another one. Oh. A new suit, the beach, what, and boys. What's his story? Yeah, why wasn't he on Meet the Boys? Hey, Hobbies, bones. Uh, Favourite snack, like spare ribs. Yes, can be Please found at graveyard. Yeah. <laughs> I'd like to or in the school. Not, yeah. But she's probably got some juicy gossip. Look at Let's the hair on the left in particular. It's yeah. like someone spilled hey, coke all over her. Looks kind of delicious oh, actually. Kate. I sort of Hi, wish Ashley. I could eat it. You guys, yeah. I'm so glad you're here. This is terrible. The oh. absolute worst. Oh, the flippers. I didn't see it all. Well, I did see part of it. Oh, I can't believe she did this. Get a grip, Taylor. Let's go through the who, what, where, and when. It all happened so quick. One minute, there was this note on your locker, and the next, well, Courtney was tearing it into pieces all the way down the hall. No, Courtney, why? Salvage. I'm afraid it's not of any And there's that 2D asset, so we can... Hmm. Hey, Mary-Kate, we hope school be Saturday B. Well, we know what was written to me, and it looks like it might have to do with someone hoping I was trying to work out what she was even saying we then. We hope school B Saturday B. <laughs> what? The Here come the men in black. Team? That's you nice, throw it. You gotta let go. His videos are the coolest. Oh my god. His videos are the coolest. I've heard this. Says... Don't forget to sing that bell. That's so not fair. You're so lucky. I can't get one person to ask me, and you've got two, maybe more. I've gotta go. Wait till everyone hears about this. Why can't I get a date? Maybe I talk too much? 
<laughs> I was just about to say, sure. maybe you talk too much. Oh, but it's my hair. She's still going. Maybe I should put it up. Definitely talks too much. Well, it looks like the only way to put this to bed is to find Courtney. Okay, so as you may have surmised, the girls learn their arch enemy, Courtney, has been seen near their lockers. On investigation, or near their lockers, sorry, on investigation they find a piece of torn up note, an invitation to a beach party, no less. They have no idea who it's from. This sets the scene for a series of challenges, the rewards for which are further pieces of the note, which eventually reveals which of the cute guys has a crush on them. Wow. Both of them. Not, not any one of them. Both of them, apparently. One oh, guy has, oh, a, has crush a crush on them. on them. Well, they are twins, so, you know, sure. they just look the same. That's and they, fine. they have absolutely no distinguishing personality features. They are the same person. They are just clones. Help the teen twins piece together a secret note by completing fun challenges. More than 30 levels have you saving whales as a marine biologist, captaining the cheerleading squad, exploring the physics of mini golf, and joining the yearbook staff as, as photo editor. Exploring the physics of mini golf. Yep. Along the way, you oh. can pick your outfit and perform with the dance squad. Just who is the mystery admirer? Multiple endings will keep you guessing. Single or two player modes let you play alone with a friend or even with your self. Own twin. Yes. Which is the same as we've already discussed. Uh, ben, I'm just going to hold down on the thumbstick. Ah. It was doing... Is this the physics? Yeah, look, it just changed direction. Is this random. the physics of mini golf? Yeah, I think it could be. She seems a bit happier now, but it, I think she was getting warmed up. Um, it's like when you de-ice your car in the morning. This is the fresh manhole. Uh, go, what? Go Bobcats. The fresh manhole? Manhole. Oh, sorry. The okay. fresh manhole. There's, oh! Oh! Oh, what? you slipped on the... Is that I, the torn note? Did I slip on that paper? Let me try again. Yes, <laughs> I did. Why? That's interesting. That's your locker. That's where the notes all torn oh. up. Physics. So this is going to be mini golf, is it? It's going to be something. I have a list of Probably. various mini games here. The physics class, where a game of mini golf is used to explore gravity, velocity, and friction. There's no way it's that complicated. There she is. There's Courtney. Let's get her. Whoa. Let's think about it. Whoa. Where do you think this bus is headed? It's a physics club field trip. Do we really want to give up our afternoon for this? What? We go on this field trip, which leads to Courtney, which leads to a piece of the note. Note plus beach party equals boys. Money can be exchanged for goods and services. Equals boys, yeah. Note and beach party can be exchanged for okay. boys and services. Find a seat and simmer down. Of course. Where is she? You know, like at school, you can just like jump on a bus that's going to a field trip and the teacher just says, yeah, get on, simmer down. Oh no, Courtney tricked you. Oh. No! Now we're having to go and do physics. Damn it. was created as a small tribute to Albert Einstein's brilliant theory of relativity. Did you know that according to Einstein's oh, amazing mini golf C squared theory, it's actually possible to travel through time? Walk up to the ball to putt with a capital P. Put. Oh. Timing's everything. Oh! oh! <laughs> Part two, swing one, grade A. Let's flip and go. Yes, baby. Do you think it's 18 holes? I certainly this hope so. It's volumes about the science of modern communications. And the discovery of the telephone was made by bit. accident in 18. The discovery of the telephone. Oh, no. Like it was buried what? somewhere. It was done by accident. Won't be recorded as an accident. <laughs> What's <laughs> this? Both of those facts sa sound wrong. Oh. Oh wow, I got done by friction there. We're learning all about the physics Oh of... yeah, run. Hold square to walk. This is me walking, this is me running. I'm hoping actually if I just get it to sort of roll over the hole... It, it might just, just magnet in. I yeah. imagine if this was a realistic physics game. That's not oh, fair. Oh wow, so I actually have to give that full welly. So you're playing as Ashley currently. What? That is... Well, what am I supposed to do? Absolute max. Power drive. Whoa! Oh, come on. This so is ridiculous. You're, you're going to need to do a little putt. Yeah, to get it closer. That's okay. it. Okay, now full power. Yeah. It's going to go flying over, isn't it? <laughs> it's, it's one or the other. I it perfectly. Ooh. That is stupid, isn't it? It's in the, it's in the floor already. It's in the floor, yeah. Full power. <laughs> yeah. 
All the boys. Oh, oh F. F. Oh, the average grade down Half to a C. Three. Still pretty good. Back when the ancient Egyptians invented the telephone. <laughs> Discovered the telephone. Bonk. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Don't really understand where the hole the, is. Where's the hole? Oh. We're going to, we're go oh. Oh, that's a good place. Now you've got to go find it. Oh, it I can't control left? the camera, I'm not allowed. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's down there through all this. Traditionally, where your ball, your pinball would go when you lose. Yeah. So you want to yeah, get it in the middle and then roll it down. I know you have I know you have this much control over where it goes. Oh. Oh. I hope you're getting a high score for this. Yeah. Right, I'm going to bounce it off. off yeah. Here. Yeah. Oh. Ho ho. Yes. Oh, right, I won. As, hey. they, as they say halfway through a golf course, oh. great, I won. You can right. see that they've actually installed a giant particle accelerator right here on the course. How did they do what that? Does a particle accelerator do you ask? Well, scientists sometimes use these devices to accelerate very small particles to near the speed of light. Now, if you can make it past those energy fields and into the accelerator, well then you'll make your fastest and easiest hole in one yet. Go for it. Go for it. Go for it. Get to get an inflatable coat. Inflatable what? On, on. I think as on. soon as they start disappearing, you can go. Oh. Oh, oh, time. oh! Oh! The particles! Oh, it's positive. Oh, You've we made the baked beans. The, the Higgs boson. Yeah, you're one over par at the moment. Yeah, I am. So you just need to get under, and then that'll be ah ah. You will test Sir Isaac Newton's laws of motion. If your ball touches any of the conveyor belts, it will follow in their direction because of the forces of motion they create. Did you? Yeah. Did you? I don't. Did did I? Just gonna go for a walk. I'm gonna work this out. Okay. Oh, the conveyor belts. Oh. Yes, there she goes. I, I was hoping <laughs> the camera how, wouldn't follow her. That's how she was made, I think. Yeah, she came out of a factory. Oh, very nice. Oh. Um, oh, that's not quite oh. where I want it to be, but that, oh. that might still. Oh, oh, well oh. Then, that's stupid, isn't it? Yeah. How are you going to get it to land conveyors. on that? Perfect. Yeah, get better conveyors, idiots. I think it's par three or par five. I saw a five, although I guess. Oh, no. Oh, but oh. it's hole five, so it must Good. be par you three. You've got some speed. <laughs> well, this is this is a, a swell view. Yeah, it is. Okay. Ooh. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, I hope you're really excited for uh, the cheerleading tryouts. Yeah, can't wait. Where the player B. has to match the moves made by the gym teacher. We did it, Ashley. We did it. Yeah, and for physics field trip, I want donuts. it was pretty fun. Yeah, but still no note from Courtney. Note? Is this what you're looking for? Courtney dropped this by me when she was on the bus earlier. <laughs> hey, let's see that. Pointy hand. I've been trying to decipher it. She's used a very complex encryption technique this time. Has she? These are the physics nerds, of course. She, yeah. She likes me. I knew it. All those years, all those glaring looks of avoiding me in the halls, and now this. She's playing hard to get. Yes, Courtney, my dear, your Byron has broken your code of love. No. Oh. They're like, they're a different color from the rest of him. Yeah, they are. Okay. Hey, Mary, hey, Mary Kate. Kate. We hope. We hope. Let. See you, School Beach, Saturday B. Mary Kate, we're gonna need more <laughs> That's brilliant, I love oh, that. What attention to detail. That's really good. So they already know it's, I think they've established it's a beach party. Just ask someone where the beach party is it's this weekend. It's on Saturday. How like you've got could it be? all of the information, Saturday B. So as I mentioned before, there's nothing about this game online. There are no professional reviews. IGN wrote a preview. Two years ago, Destructoid Zoe Handley wrote an article titled Let's Relive the Unspeakable Horrors of High School with Mary Hyphen Kate and Ashley Crush Cross. Mm. That's it. That's all there is online, really. That's the sort of vibes I'm getting. Like, the, you know, the the nerdy kids are the butt of the joke. And, you mm -hmm. know, there's a, re a really bitchy, horrible, popular girl who they hate. Who's and... really good at cryptology. Apparently. Yeah. She can just... Tackle her to the ground. She's got it. Why is she carrying around individual bits of notes? Oh, well, no. your horoscope was wrong. What will we do now? You're trying out for cheerleader? 
Keep an eye on that clipboard. You're trying out for cheerleader, she says. Okay, Both of them like dressed in <laughs> cheerleading outfits. I feel like they've got every outfit. Do you ready? Yeah. This is the one where you have to copy the Why gym teacher. Stretch out while I get set up on the field. The field? Okay, Go Biscuits, I think it says on that. May have said Bobcats. Uh, I think it's Bobcats, but I prefer Biscuits. Yeah. Rich team. This is how it's going to work. I'll show you a cheer sequence and you have to repeat And I'm your freestyle dance instructor. <laughs> but I'm looking for sharp motions and good timing. I'll pick one of you as the newest member of our squad after we've completed the tryout. This is really exciting. Yeah. Oh, think of the opportunities. Me. Right. Who the heck? What's going on in the back? <laughs> Chew, chew, chew. Good, that's good so far. There he goes, he's still going. Interesting gate. The symbols. Oh. Down. <laughs> what was that? That was me <laughs> mashing the down button. <laughs> make a honk noise. Mr. Toad has arrived. Yeah, she's doing better. The one on the other girl's doing a lot better than you. Kick. What? Kick. Oh. <laughs> poop, poop. Spin, kick, spin, spin, spin. Oh. <laughs> spin, kick. Spin, spin, spin. How am I she supposed is, to get um, the first she's one? She's amazing. She's absolutely right. destroying you. Your score isn't moving weirdly. Now you'll have to memorize the moves I show you, so concentrate. Oh, oh. no. Up. Down. Up. <laughs> Down. Down. At least it shows me where they're supposed to be. Guys, don't you have classes? What are you doing back there? Oh. <laughs> what happens if you lose a minigame? Right. No idea. You have to we have do, to do it, it again. again. Oh, God. Down. Oh, come on, how am I? <laughs> yeah, why am I not gaining stars? Do the opposite of the displayed moves now. What? Do the opposite of X? I do have to do the opposite of X, Surely that's triangle. triangle. Oh, God. She's not even <laughs> saying them in time. <laughs> All I can hear is the bloody tooting. Right, left, right. I did my best. Oh, she's knackered. Not bad, Mary Kate, but I still think the spot on the squad is mine. Yeah, I think yeah, so too. Probably. Here comes Nikki. Well, girls, you both worked real hard, but unfortunately, we can only take one of you. And the one we selected is Courtney. Congratulations. Courtney. Right. Courtney. Yes, I won. I mean, I knew I'd win. Looks That's like just as bad. Yeah. I don't know why you corrected yourself. <laughs> That's really too bad, Mary Kate. Yeah, thanks. Yeah. Thanks a lot. Not making the cheer team is not half as bad as not getting the note. <laughs> nice try, but Courtney won. Go back to school. Surely you can go to oh. a different class. So the marine biology class is a timed game where the object is to collect creatures and litter. The marine biology, who the One hell? One goes into the bin and the other is returned to the sea. So I hope you're ready to scoop up. Oh, oh I forgot about that. <laughs> scoop up all the plastic straws and release them back into the ocean. Yeah, feed them to the turtles. Oh, so you've done shut. You've done yeah. It seems like maybe the only What's door that's open. Can I help you, Mary Kate? No. It didn't happen to see Courtney? Uh, no. Nope. Not today. I hope you and your sister are planning to help with the beach cleanup project. Oh, that's marine. That sounds like marine biology to me. There he is. Surely it's not going to it's not going to make you do cheerleading again. Well, because right? that game was hard. All the other doors appear to be closed. I'm afraid. Courtney was really good at this. Really good. Tell you what, we'll come back when Peter's. How did that? Near the end. <laughs> So here's a preview of some of the other classes you could have gone to. There's obviously the marine biology class I already talked about. There's the journalism class, where the players must explore the school and take photographs of the people on their assignments list. The talent show, where the object is to follow the instructor's moves and beat Courtney. Oh no, that sounds familiar. Oh, okay. Journalism, again, but this time the player is taking pictures for the school yearbook. Finally, there's a series of seaside arcade games including Ball Toss, Treasure Hunt, and Hoops. Almost in a time. I'm having oops. The going eBay price for a pre-owned copy is about £2.50 for a PC version, £5 for a PS1 copy, and £15 plus for a boxed Game Boy Color version. Right. I've got a couple of Amazon reviews here. Matilda Bollinger left a review on the 22nd of July 2003 saying, great, a game for girls! Two exclamation marks. 
They gave it five stars and they said, my nine-year-old daughter recently bought this game and loves it. Okay, once she's done all... Nine-year-old daughter, by the yeah. way, Peter, just to put that into context for you. Once she's done all the levels, there probably isn't much else for her to do, but she will have enjoyed doing it. And isn't it about time there were some PlayStation games that don't involve fighting, shooting, or driving? That's right. Eight people found this helpful. Eight people. Eight people. The other review I've got here is from Amazon customer who gave it two stars and they said better than Dance Party of the Century at least. Compared to Dance Party of the Century, Crush Course is a huge step forward. Realistically though, it's like playing something made in the early 90s but with added frustration. Mm. I think I just... She's tired oh, now. Yeah. She's tired now. Who's Hell tired now? Yes. Courtney. Here comes Nikki. Biscuits. Go, go biscuits. Well, girls, you both worked real hard, but unfortunately, we can only take one of you. And the one we selected is Mary Kate. Yes. Mary hyphen Kate. I won. My man. I won. One new cheerleader. It only took three tries. Third time is the charm. What's it going to say this time though? Too long to ask, but. Would you two like to hang out? You two? Meaning me? Let see you. Let. School Beach, Saturday B. I'm liking this what new strange place. School Beach. Nice. There's a school beach? Seemingly. Well, we've got that marine class to go to now, haven't we? So Yeah, we should at least start that and see what it's like. And I'll give you your reviews. Oh, oh bloody oh. hell, where were we? What is, are those buses out there? <laughs> look, at, look <laughs> why have they parked them on the giant cabbages? So I'll wait for this game to get started and then you can guess. Hi, have any of you seen Courtney? Was. No, but her name's on the list. This is a sign-up sheet for the student volunteers that have already headed down to the beach. To the beach? The beach? Yeah, the storm we just had caused a huge mess. You know, mess. the school beach. The school beach. We've got some friends on our table, by the way. Yeah, we have. And of course, we uh, we're going to introduce them to you too. from right to left to left to right. Courtney. Duck My Chinko. Brian Bumblepiss. Ruse Boss. Ashton Catfuse. And, and Billy, Billy Ray Walrus. Walrus. Oh, well, well, Ashley, we're here, but I don't see any... Oh, no, they're flipper feet. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's for swimming. You, me, it's very true, actually. Oh, there's that man. Look, Ashley, it's Mr. Warden. I'm uh, glad you two could join us. We've got a lot of work to do. Have we? We're ready to help. By the way, do you know where Courtney is? Yeah, I, I know where the other cove is. I, I'm heading over there right now. Go ahead and get started with the cleanup here and get the animals back in the ocean and pick up the trash scattered around the beach. Uh, I'll, I'll be That's a lot of instructions. Wait, but what, what about Courtney? It's no use, Mary Kate. He can't hear us. I would love That's for she says to boundary break this game. Yeah. You just, I just want to see that scene. I just want to see the scene from a different angle. Yeah, oh, get all the, the animals. Timer runs back out. In water and clean up all the trash. Yes. What do you? Got it. Drop the trash in the bin. Oh no, you picked up. Oh, I've put. I've got three animals. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So now you need to go to wherever the animal. Oh, oh, what was that? I don't know. Well, the creatures probably wanted to be on the land. Yeah, it's <laughs> why, not far. Why are you putting the crabs back in the sea? Okay. What do you reckon the average score is according to user reviews on GameFAQs? User reviews on GameFAQs, uh, they'll be all over the place. Probably 2.5 out of... I've percentaged it. Uh, so, did I mean out of 10 or did I mean out of 5? I think I mean out of 5, so about 50%. 43%. Okay. And there are quite a few reviews on there, actually. Uh, I've got the lowest review score and the highest review score based on the one written review on GameFAQs. Okay. And another written review I could find on the internet. Uh, so here we go. This is from Crazy Raccoon 2 on GameFAQs. This game belongs in a garbage can along with the Olsen sisters. Whoa. Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> Rent or buy? Don't even look at this game. It's too hideous. Run away. What did Crazy Raccoon 2 give uh, Mary Hyphen and Kate and Ashley Crush Course? I don't know, but if it belongs in the garbage bin, I've got to make sure I don't put it in the sea by accident. No. Um, they gave it, you say percentage, if you mm -hmm. percentaged it, uh, 10%. 10% exactly. Yes. Well done. One out of 10. The highest review score is from a user called Skeleton Gaming from howlongtobeat.com. Right. Uh, and they said, it's a bunch of very boring mini games strung together, nothing remarkable in the slightest. The one saving grace this game has, however, is the music. 
Sure, half the soundtrack is generic preteen rock band crap with generic guitars and the such, but then some of it is actually quite well composed and well made, which is rather bizarre for this game. Oh. Also, there are skeletons everywhere for some reason. I can respect this. What did Skeleton Gaming give the game out of 100? Oh, I see. If I step on the seaweed, how does it make you slip? I slip and drop every, or drop like one item. Uh, they gave it 40 percent. They gave it 30 percent. They also gave it an additional rating, which they call their skeleton rating, because of course this is skeleton gaming. Uh, they gave it a skeleton rating of 60 percent, saying a surprising amount of skeleton content, as there are just skeletons all around the school. That's true. Oh so they only play games. They really love medieval. They on always PS1. put an additional rating in for skeleton. Yeah. A skeleton rating of 60 percent. Uh, so there we are. That is all my science facts. We made it through. We're now probably one of very few places oh, yeah. who have covered this it, game it seem... in any capacity on the uh, internet. Oh, there's more. In any kind of detail. 199 seconds is an awful long time. You don't want to play while no, we're saying I goodbye? Don't. You don't. I'll, I'll play while you say goodbye. If Help. You Delete the game. Drop off animal slash trash. Thank you, everyone, for watching me play this terrible game and Ben talk about this terrible game. Uh, did you know that, oh, that was a whole turtle there? Well, I yeeted it accidentally. Oh, look at it. Uh, did you know that you can support this show by sharing this video somewhere on the internet? And, of course, with your friends and family as well. But you can perhaps post this on the um, hyphen subreddit, r slash hyphens. They just talk about dashes all the time over there. Um, yes. And they have a good time. Um, uh, you can also, of course, get this show a couple of days early, two whole days early by heading to patreon.com forward slash team triple jump and signing up to the relevant tier where you get early access to worst games ever and also our monthly show, weirdest games ever, worst games being a fortnightly show, uh, weirdest games ever, a whole week early if you sign up to the uh, relevant tier. So consider doing that if you want to support us financially and get early access to some content. So do it, do it. Ben, are you done? You enjoying this little I'm having a great time. Look how, look how expansive this place is. Yeah. Oh. oh no. It's amazing. <laughs> Can we just, look how sharp it is. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. We will see you next time. Remember, not much time left for the tat appeal. And thank no. you already if you've sent stuff in. Jeff on screen. Oh. There we go. And it's gone. Stay safe, everybody. Bye. Bye.